arm sequence. Stay tuned. Find out. What are the sequence of the movements in the golf swing? I'm going to show you standing up. So you get a little better idea. We'll uh, get rid of some of these angles so things will be a little bit more clear. So we go back to the top of the backswing. First sequence is your core turns. Next thing that happens is your arms get pulled down. Now I'm sure everybody's seen this position. Uh, anytime you look for it or see any slow motions, you see every good golfer go through it. Uh, they have a lot of different names for it. But whatever you want to call it, uh, every golfer goes through this position. And you get here by your arms dropping. Your arms go from the top of your backswing position. And they just drop straight down. I know it's going to be a surprise to a lot of you that your arms are not swinging around your body, but they're not. So the first big movement with your arms is not a cross, but you turn and your arms drop straight down. because your trunk trans energy to your arms and your arms pull it down. The next big s transfer of energy is from your arms to the club head. At this point, the club head will pull the shaft down. Now at this point, you've locked out this joint right here. Get back to it. You've locked out that joint so it can't go any farther. And the energy has moved out to the toe. When the energy moves out to the toe, it will start pulling the toe around the shaft and close the club face. And at this point, the energy is still out on the end and it's going to pull your arms forward. That's the motion of your arms, or actually the whole motion in the golf swing. Again, you get to the top of your back swing, you turn your core, the arms drop, the head drops, the head turns, and then it pulls your arms through.